Yo, what's up YouTube, Kenzie here, and finally I'm back with a tutorial for you guys. Sorry that I haven't been uploading for so long, um, but as you guys know, I was on vacation for a bit last week, and, and this week I had problems with my connection, something was messed up, I wasn't able to upload any videos. Um, it's sad, I need 1000 minutes to upload a video, and that was too much for me. So I'm just starting off now, um, I have a 3 months break now so you will see a lot of videos now from me um, and don't see anything about my desktop background I know we lost but I'm staying to my team but yeah anyway uh, <laughs> let's get it started um, so here we actually got the stuff we are gonna do today um, it's a simple 2D text effect which looks pretty sick and pretty good um, I really like this effect and I don't really see people using it so I'm just gonna show you how you do it um, because I think if you make a 2d background this could look really sick so let's get it started and first thing you need is a normal text layer like this one um, the font is agency FB if you don't know this already and first thing we are gonna do is a uh, rasterize type of the text layer and uh, actually the background color is 3E 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 um, yeah, I'll tell you when you need this so for first you just duplicate uh, no not duplicate the layer make a new layer and hold control and click on that little picture in front of the layer where the text is that it selects the text so now go and select modify expand and expand by 10 pixels should be enough so now you just go and choose a kind of light gray or something and go on your new layer and just cut it out press ctrl D to deselect it and then just get the normal or the, the layer we start with on the top so what we are going to do now is just add some effects to this go and create an overlay and now you need this 3e 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 thing um, as the first color you make 3e 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 or however your uh, background is minus 3e 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 that's why I'm using this um, and the other one just make it a bit darker 33333 three, three, three would be enough here. So, okay, then go to Drop Shadow, make the blend mode to normal, the color to white, the opacity to 50%, the distance to 2, speed 0, and size 2 as well. Now go to Inner Shadow, keep it black, make the opacity to 100%, and make it uh, distance 5, choke 0 and size 5 as well. So now you see you got a pretty cool uh, 3D effect on a 2D text and to finish it off you just go to the other layer and add a stroke on 1 or 2 yeah 2 looks good, no 1. <laughs> um, and then go to drop shadow make it black opacity 100% and just make it the same distance and size you made the inner shadow on the other layer so just 5, 0 and 5 and you will be done um, this is actually a really uh, simple tutorial um, and I hope it helps out a lot of you guys um, it's a pretty cool effect you can use in 2D backgrounds or or in some other stuff. Um, it looks pretty cool, I think. Um, so yeah, that would be from me for today. Uh, also, Evil's promo will be up this weekend, so stay tuned on that channel. Um, I'll also upload it on here. Um, and then you guys know when we are gonna start being active um, it will be a sick clan I hope it's gonna be 
really huge and yeah so I hope you all enjoyed this please leave a like and a comment and if you haven't subscribed yet please go to my channel and subscribe it and yeah I'm out peace